It was a big day out at Blackthorn in South Bend. The Four Winds Invitational began today. Yeah, here's a look at what Pete Byrne had today. The Four Winds Invitational teed off bright and early Friday morning at Blackthorn Golf Club with a hint of rain still in the air. This is the 8.30 starting time. With the soft greens, the players were shooting right for the pins. Jamila Jaxalieva hits one tight into the par 5 sixth. The amateur from Kazakhstan shoots a 3 under par 69. Several players with local ties are playing this week. 2007 Notre Dame graduate Noriko Nakazaki turned in one of the best rounds of the day. Wow. She hits a great shot into the 18th green to cap off a two under par round. I actually finished very strong. I had an eagle today on 14, and from there I birdie birdied and finished par par. So I just really finished strong. Recent Penn High School graduate and soon to be Notre Dame golfer Carrie Belleville had the largest gallery of the day following her group. Belleville hits a nice approach into the sixth green, leading to an easy par. It was an up and down day for Kerry. She finished with a six over par, 78. The girls I played with today were just amazing. They both birdied the first hole, and I was just in awe of both of them playing. It was like a great round just to watch them like compete and them to shoot under and just watch them and how they did every situation that they put themselves in and everything. Playing in the same group as Carrie Belleville was Lindy Duncan, who turned in a marvelous round. On the par 5 sixth, Duncan drains the long part for birdie. She's also in at 3 under par 69. There's another Penn High School graduate in the field today, Julia Potter, the defending United States mid-amateur champion, playing on a sponsor's exemption. She got through Blackthorn with an even par round of 72 and is in solid position to make the cut. After 18 holes, they're all chasing Nicole Vandermeer. The Canadian birdied six consecutive holes on her back nine en route to an eight under par 64 to lead the tournament after day one. I hit a lot of fairways, hit a lot of greens, and I just happened to be really close to the hole, and I read them right, and they went in soft greens and barely any wind, so it's kind of like a recipe for a good score. And a good score is exactly what we saw from her and the rest of the leaders. We take a look at the leaderboard now. A lot of low scores. Uh, interesting stat to pass along. This is the third year of the Four Winds Invitational. Two years ago, there were only six players under par on day one. Last year, 33 players under par. Today, with the soft conditions, 52 players. Nearly half this field, more than the third at least, under par. Right now, the projected cut is at even, which would be by far the lowest the cut has ever been in this tournament in the years that they've had it here. Again, you still got to play 36 more holes before this is decided, but it's shaping up to be a very exciting tournament here at the Four Winds Invitational at Blackthorn. A couple other sports notes to pass along. Right now, the Cubs are leading the Pittsburgh Pirates 6-3 to three at last check. And tonight, is going to be a very special Notre Dame football recruiting camp going on on campus, referred to as the Irish Invasion. Carl Deffenbaugh is going to have everything from that coming for you tonight at 11. But uh, for now, as you can see, beautiful conditions out here at Blackthorn as we look up the 18th green uh, and shaping up to be a very exciting weekend here at the Four Winds Invitational.